On August 21st, the Exploratorium will present a sonification of the total eclipse of the sun, turning this celestial event into a musical performance. But how do you make music from an eclipse? To answer this question, let's look at the core of the sun. Here, nuclear particles collide with such force that they cause a special kind of explosion called nuclear fusion. Fusion produces a helium nucleus and a lot of light. Our sonification process turns this sunlight into sound. To see how it works, let's follow a single photon of light as it goes through this conversion. About 8.3 minutes after leaving the sun, this ray of light will arrive on planet Earth in Casper, Wyoming. Our team will have a telescope set up there to catch this photon. The photon will then be converted into a digital image, brightening a single pixel. This pixel will then be sent by radio back into space. A satellite will relay the signal, which will eventually arrive at the Exploratorium in San Francisco. Here, we will take the pixel's digital information and feed it into our customized piece of software, which will use the specific details of the pixel to generate a unique corresponding sound. The Kronos Quartet will be on stage at the Exploratorium with a live feed from the telescope. When the pixel arrives, it will generate a noise, and the quartet will play along with whatever this sound happens to be. This is what our sonification process looks like when applied to a single photon. Meanwhile, back in the sun, fusion reactions are producing a large number of photons. These photons flood the telescope, producing a full image of the sun. Working with our partners from NASA, we will operate a fleet of solar viewing telescopes. From Wyoming, we'll be able to capture the total solar eclipse, broadcasting a live feed of the event as it happens. Back at the Exploratorium, the pixels making up these high-definition solar images will be fed through our sonification software, producing a rich sonic background which will gradually change as the moon moves in front of the sun. The Kronos Quartet will accompany the eclipse live at the museum. The sonification with live telescope feeds can be viewed on our website or by downloading our free Eclipse Viewing app for iOS and Android devices.